हेलो एवरीवन हाउ आर यू वेलकम अगेन टू आर यूट्यूब चैनल इंजीनियर्स वर्ल्ड सो दिस इज अ शॉर्ट वीडियो इन विच आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट वेरियस इंपॉर्टेंट आई एस कोर्स विच आर डायरेक्टली आस्ड इन द एग्जाम्स लाइक एस एस सी जेई एंड अदर स्टेट जेई एग्जाम्स सो लेट एस स्टार्ट वन बाय वन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट बेसिक Indian Standard Code for Structural Design. So the first and the most important is our IS four five six. All of you might have heard about this, and this IS four five six, and I am talking about IS four five six two thousand. So this code of practice is for. plain and a reinforced concrete code of practice so wherever the um, designing of uh, plain and reinforced concrete is concerned we refer this code not only designing and uh, various other formulas are also written now the second one is is 875 1987 see uh, is 875 is regarding code of practice for design loads now it has further five parts and i'll be discussing each part one by one so is 875 part 1 this code of practice is regarding uh dead load next is is 875 part 2 so this code of practice is regarding live loads or imposed load now coming to is 875 part 3 and this is code is uh, regarding wind load so if you have to perform wind load analysis or design we refer is 875 part 3 now coming to is 875 part 4 so this is code is for snow load so for snow load calculation we refer part 4 of is 875 and coming to the last part that is 875 part 5 this code of practice is regarding special loads and load combinations so whenever we have to apply load combinations as well as special loads we refer this part of is 875 that is part 5 now we will move on to next or next is all right here or third is is 1893 2002 see in these course some course may be revised but i am talking about the uh what the codes what these codes are related to or why these codes are used and where they are used so is 1893 2002 it is code of practice uh, regarding the criteria for earthquake resistant design of structures so if you have to make a quick resistant design of a structure we refer is 1893 so this is also one of the important co is codes now we will be moving on now moving on to next or uh, next one is is 
वन थ्री नाइन टू जीरो इट्स पार्ट मे बी रिवाइज इन इयर टू थाउजेंड फोर्टीन और सिक्सटीन बट आई एम ऑल्सो आई एम ओनली कंसर्न विद द यूज ऑफ दिस कोड सो आई एस थर्टीन वन थ्री नाइन टू जीरो इज रिगार्डिंग द टाइल डिटेलिंग ऑफ आर सी सी स्ट्रक्चर्स subjected to seismic forces so if you have to do the tactile detailing of rcc structure subjected to seismic forces we will refer this code now moving on to the next types of is codes see we have uh, these were is codes for these i scores that i discussed yet these were standard uh, i scores for structural design now uh, i'll be talking about codes for steel used as reinforcement codes for now we will be discussing about the codes of steel so the first one is is 800 so this is code is regarding design of steel structures there are some also other types of is codes like is 432 part 1 1982 uh, this code of steel is for specification for mild steel and medium tensile steel bars for concrete specification for mild steel and medium tensile steel bars for concrete reinforcement concrete uh, reinforcement so this was is 432 third one is is 1786 1985 uh, this code is regarding specification for high strength deformed bars so it is regarding specification for hysd bars for concrete reinforcement so these were some of the important codes for steel now moving on to the next important is codes that is codes for concrete so under this the first and the most important is is 10262 1982 so this is code is regarding recommended guidelines for concrete mix design so whenever we perform a mix concrete mix design we refer to this code now the second is is 3370 part 1 1965 this code is for this code of practice is for storage of liquids you can say water tanks now moving on to the next that is is 
1959. This code of practices regarding the methods of methods of test for strength of concrete. Methods of test for strength of concrete. The next one is this is also one of the important IS codes for concrete. IS 1343 1980. This IS code is this code of practices for pre stressed concrete. So, whenever we are designing pre stressed concrete, we refer to IS 1343. Pre stressed concrete. So, these were some of the important codes for uh, concrete. Now, we will see some codes of aggregate. Codes for aggregates. Under this, the first one is IS 383, 1970. So this is regarding specification for coarse and fine aggregates from natural sources for concrete. Specification for coarse aggregates and fine aggregates from natural sources. For concrete. Next one is IS two three eight six. It has parts one to eight. So these codes of practice are for methods of test for aggregate for. Uh, methods of testing of aggregates for concrete. For concrete. So, these were some of the important IS codes for aggregates. Now, uh, <coughs> See, I'm talking about only important codes. There are a lot of uh, IS codes, but we will be talking about only those codes which are important and um, which are uh, used a lot. So, so our last types of codes is for codes of cement. Codes for cement. So, under this, the first one is IS 269 1989 So this IS code is for uh, regarding specification for 33 grade 33 grade OPC Ordinary Portland Cement Next one is IS 8112 1989 and this is regarding specification for 43 grade OPC. Or next one is IS 1227. And this IS code is regarding specification for 53 grade OPC. So these were some of the important IS codes which I have discussed so far. I hope you have uh, liked this video